Sometimes the spirit of adventure beckons so much it's pointless to resist it. Some people find enough courage to get on a train and head off into outer space. Hmm. No. Also no. Wrong again. These are all wrong stories. Ah, there it is, the forest. This train was passing through impenetrable, dense forests. However, that was not a nameless journey, but a long way up here, right into the heart of the endless, snowy nowhere. A perfect place for those who prefer tranquility, silence, and minus 45 degrees outside the window. Urgh. Meet the man who made off into this palace of silence, the engineer. He'll be here on watch duty for many long and cold months, until the next lucky guy strides in to replace him. If one comes through at all, of course. But there's no need to feel sorry for him. Although the terrain is wild, there's plenty to see and do around here. Especially if you're curious enough. Fortunately for my story, engineers are almost always inquisitive and attentive. These people notice things that elude the average person. And everything would have been fine in this adventure if the blizzard had not started at the wrong time. The chilly wind blew the engineer off the trail, which he immediately lost sight of. His fingers instantly turned into ice like everything else around him. The last hope of salvation, a map of the terrain, treacherously slipped out of his hands. Luckily, the video's timing didn't allow the engineer to suffer for long. All of a sudden, in the middle of snowy nowhere, it appeared. A door to... Where to, by the way? The building didn't seem to be on the engineer's maps. Anybody home? This is how it all usually starts. In that strange hut, there was nothing. No people. No warmth. Only darkness. If I were you, I'd look for a key. Or something that looks like a key. Maybe just something heavy. I think that's going to help. Hmm, a heavy blunt object. Gotta grab it. I'm afraid there's nothing left to fix with a hammer. Any other ideas? Oh, <clears throat> 
And so, my glorious hero, having passed all the hardships of his watch, finally obtains a light in order to... Hmm. To notice something strange on the table? Finally awake? Hmm. A typical day on watch, huh? might come in handy. an inventive mind wouldn't have any trouble figuring out the mechanism of a simple trolley. Well, pretty much. Try pulling the other lever. All right now. Just slowly. book you've picked up? Is the author some kind of scientist or inventor? 
I hope he's not too upset that we stole his train. That was awkward. Thank you. 